the pleasure of presenting a proclamation in recognition of Women's History Month. So I'm going to read this proclamation and then I'm going to present it to our Girl Scouts here. And then is somebody going to speak? Okay. And then after that I would like to shake hands with the city council members. So, whereas on June 10th, 1919, Wisconsin became the first state to ratify the 19th Amendment granting national suffrage to women. This helped inspire the campaign that culminated in the 19th Amendment to the United States Constitution in 1920 when women won the right to vote nationally. And whereas since 1914, Margie has been recognized as International Women's Day, and since 1987, March has been designated National Women's History Month. And the President of the United States has proclaimed March to be National Women's History Month. And whereas March is Women's History Month in recognition of the role played by women in the growth and development of our economy, our government, our culture, and artistic achievements, and many other areas of accomplishment. Whereas women constitute a majority of Sunbury's population and a significant portion of the labor force, making countless contributions to our community across every facet of life. And whereas many women are committed to their dual roles as professional women and citizens, women of every race, ethnicity, sexual orientation, ability, and social economic background continue to make historic contributions to the growth and strength of Sun Prairie, Wisconsin, our nation, and the global community. And whereas women from all backgrounds have fought for equal treatment for all, recognizing that together women have made great strides. Whereas American women have become leaders not only in securing their own rights of suffrage and equal opportunity, but also in the abolitionist movement, the emancipation movement, the industrial labor movement, the civil rights movement, and other movements, especially the peace movement, which create a fair and just society for all. Whereas, despite these contributions, the roles of American women in history have been consistently overlooked and undervalued in literature, teaching, and study of American history. Now, therefore, I, Paul Lesser, by virtue of the authority vested in me as mayor, on behalf of the city of Sun Prairie, hereby proclaim the month of March as Women's History Month. So, I want to present this to the girls collectively, and if you turn around, there. Let's get in. <laughs> you go ahead and hold on. Okay. Very good. All right. So now do we have a speaker. <laughs> in honor of Women's History Month, our troop worked hard last night building a quilt rack for storage purposes for our very own history museum and it is sitting right outside of the room if anyone wants to take a look at it the girls all got a chance to work with hammers and drills um, last night in constructing it and then they all signed their names to it to move on for posterity so happy women's history month great